What's up guys? Welcome back to day three of Vlogmas. Hope you guys enjoyed yesterday's video talking about our favorite Christmas movies. But today, we are going to try Norwegian Christmas Soda. Oh yeah. Julebrus. Julebrus. <laughs> that one. So I just laid these out. There's no order to them. But uh, Miss Lefby, how many of these have you actually tried? These two. Okay, so these two. Okay. Yeah. Which one was your favorite? Hamsa, definitely. This one especially, I've heard about it and mm -hmm. seen it in like the tests that they come around every year, okay. obviously. Um, but this one is super popular. It has a different color oh, yeah. than the other ones, which is why to me it doesn't look like Christmas soda. I, I haven't tried it because of the color, so well, I know it's dumb. <laughs> well, let's, let's get into it. You said what brand was this one? Um, it's from uh, Lillehammer Bryggeri. Okay. Yeah. That's our first one here. If children want to drink Christmas soda, they need a wine opener. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> cool. <laughs> well, uh, hand me your glass here. We'll try. I can see what you're saying about the the color. It doesn't really, yeah, it doesn't really give off Christmas vibes like these other ones no, do. No, it doesn't. These are reds. This one, I don't know if you can tell on the camera. It's more like a. I don't know what you call it. Like a really watered down Coke would look like, maybe. <laughs> Yeah, get all that carbonation out of there. <laughs> I'm getting just like pure sugar cane notes and plastic. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here we go. Ready? Cheers. That sucks. <laughs> you like it? I, I don't really like this one. <laughs> well, what, what are your uh, first thoughts? Um, to me, it's like it reminds me of Christmas soda, but it isn't. Okay. Yeah. It just it kind of just tastes like sugar with something, but it's not enough flavor for that something to be anything. No. Like, yeah. Anyways. Number two, uh, which who uh, makes this one? Uh, Oscar Sylte. Okay. Um, and it's called Rudolf and Nissen Julebris. Ooh. And uh, Nissen is uh, Santa. Santa. Okay. Rudolf and Santa. Jule Nissen. 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 Jule Nissen. I always say Nissen. Okay. So I've been saying it incorrectly. All right. Thank you. And this is the one you have tried, but you prefer the other. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, but I don't like dislike this one. Definitely like, yeah, more of a Christmas look. Maybe a bit pinkish for Christmas, mm -hmm. but no, I won't do this for everyone, guys. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's, it smells pretty much the same. All right, here we go. Doesn't really taste much. Mm -mm. But it has slight more flavor, more of a Raspberry. fruity berry, yeah, like some kind of, a little more like that. Mm -hmm. To me, this one actually um, feels more like Christmas hmm. Eve. Okay. Yeah, because I think this is the one my, my mom gets. Okay. So, and we have... The Christmas dinner at Christmas Eve. Mm. This is usually what I drink because I I thought of that meal. That's um, cool. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, and if it's even not as strong, it that's kind of like a cool comparison, anyway. It's like yeah. Christmas soda, Christmas Eve soda. It's like getting you ready. For Christmas. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so we are on to Miss Luckley's favorite Christmas beer. Sorry, Christmas soda. I still have to record a Christmas beer episode. <laughs> How, have I been saying that? No, first time. Okay, so this is definitely a little more red. This looks good. All right. My favorite. Definitely more of a of a smell. Mm. 
Yeah. That's more of a, like a, a complete soda taste to me. Yeah. I can feel the raspberry. Mm. Like I've had like raspberry, um, raspberry candy. Mm -hmm. And this tastes like that. I, I definitely agree. This is, uh, this does taste like Christmas beer is like a candy, right? Mm -hmm. Christmas, Christmas soda is like a candy, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. This, I like it. I like it. It's, uh, this is definitely in order as of tasting. But let's get on to these, uh, to these two you haven't had. Now, hmm. It's a little, it's darker. It's a little darker. This is almost like street Christmas color. Thank you. <laughs> so I have to swirl again and dump out because I guess Miss Luckley burped while I was doing it the first time. So now I'm just wasting soda. When it's I really worth should. It. No, it's not worth it. That's good content. I should keep the burp in. All right, this looks like. Ooh, this looks like a pretty color. This. Uh, this um, os julebris. Okay, os. Os. Because this looks like ass to me. So. Yeah. <laughs> kind of to me too. I haven't. I haven't heard anyone say it before. So mm -hmm. this is um, my guess of how to say it. Okay. I'm gonna take this seriously. Let's go. Ooh. Mm. That fl that smell is so different from the first three. Yeah. These first three were definitely a progression up. This is, this, is something different. This is just different. I don't know if it's better or worse, but it's very different. Hmm. I don't think I like the taste. Like the after. I was gonna just say that there's something like weird, like it in the aftertaste. It goes yeah. like it's one flavor, then it goes zoop, like that yeah, right at the end. Weird. To be honest, if you just smell it, this this is a banana candy smell. Yeah, that's what it is. It's like banana. Yeah, it has that banana tang too at the at the very end. Oh, that's weird. Why would they put that in? Hmm. It probably doesn't say that though. No, no. It's no. just the way it, it comes out. Yeah. Yeah, I was like, I know this smell because I I hate bananas. <laughs> so like I know this smell, but I think if I'm re-ranking, no, we'll we'll rank at the end. Last one here. I don't have to get the wine bottle out. <clears throat> with the <laughs> Well maybe I do after like <laughs> after all these mess ups. I don't have to get the wine opener out. Yeah. <clears throat> this one is called God Julebrus or Gott Nyttår. Directly translated, it means Happy Julebrus and Happy New Year. Okay. So, yeah. <laughs> it's a long name for soda. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, we say like good, good Christmas okay. instead of Merry Christmas. So. Oh. Good Christmas to you all. <laughs> Let's get into it. Ooh, that smell coming off is, is new as well. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, that has more of a blueberry uh, look to it than the than these red ones. Okay. Like it's, uh, you can kind of see it's more. Yeah. yeah. It's, you smell it too. Blueberry. Mm, yeah. Dang. Nice. I think I should become a wine taster. <laughs> uh... I, I already I can pick it up on some stuff. That's nice. Really? I like that. I'm not a fan. Ooh. What was this one again? Lilla Hammer. Lilla Hammer. Just not enough uh, flavor. Not, not a not a no punch at all. Just uh, just like sugar. Um, so that's that comes in last for me. Uh, what was this one? Rudolf and Nissen. This one was pretty good. I mean, like these ones are almost tied for me. Um, this one has that slight banana. I am not a fan of banana. So personally, I may put this here. I don't know where you would put it. Um, and then the uh, Christmas Eve soda is actually directly in the middle. Do you agree with this ranking so far? Yeah, I do. 
even even with you not being a huge fan of this, would you put would you um, replace oh, any of these with? Yes. So Miss Luckley would go second to last on this one. Or even last. Or even last. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. We have a, yeah, a different taste for sure. Mm -hmm. So now it comes down to Miss Luckley's favorite Christmas. And least and, favorite. And least favorite. <laughs> <laughs> so to help us decide, the last pick we're going to have uh, who? Uh, the Norwegian Fjösnissa. Ah. Mm hmm. It means like a barn Santa type mm. thing. It's a, like a traditional Santa in Norway. Okay. And not like the. Uh, Coca-Cola Santa. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> sure. <laughs> well, that's cool. Yeah. I think that this Santa would take this one and put it second. What? And this long name one would be number one, so cheers. <laughs> really? That one was good. It was bad. No, it was good. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Okay. All these ones have like a red fruit based flavor. Mm -hmm. Except that one who just <laughs> put in sugar. Yeah. Um, this one is, feels, I don't know what it actually is, but it feels blueberry. Yeah. Like it has that blue. I'm a huge fan. This one to me had the best overall flavor. Mm -hmm. um, this one had probably the most flavor, just not a good combination yeah yours definitely is probably just right on par with this except raspberry -ish versus blueberry and in this christmas soda setting i have to go with this one but i'm gonna put this first but i can definitely see them being tied i did enjoy both of them a lot okay <laughs> well there you have it guys our ranking <laughs> And uh, yeah, if you enjoyed us taste <laughs> testing these, hit that like button for me. Um, I want to go get, there's actually a ton of uh, Christmas beer that I want to try. I think those that might have to be a two-parter. So um, yeah, here we are, the Christmas sodas. I'm having a lot of fun with Vlogmas. So thank you, shout out to Robert for uh, challenging me to this. Mm -hmm. And uh, thank you, Miss Luckley, for joining me. Sure. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow for date four of Vlogmas. All right. God yul. Good yul. Okay. <laughs> Merry Christmas, happy holidays. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs>